Hey guys, it's Tamedrickle9000, and boy, have I been busy. Woo! So, uh, as a tease on Valentine's Day, I have been working on some stuff. And we've gotten some stuff, so, uh, there's a lot of things here I was going to do it in multiple videos. Oh, frick. Uh, hold on just a second, my friends. Yeah, this is going to be a long video. Hey guys, Tabrico9000 here with a lot of stuff here and it's like a weird new setup ish I decided you know what let's film since we have so much stuff film on we have this desk back here which normally actually just has a bunch of plushies stuff from the past here you'll probably be relevant later oh you can just see stuff all over the floor like baby and some toy cheek and all that whatever oh well um some coughs and stuff down there yes Cleto will come back and Maybe a mango video. Anyway, we're not here to talk about any of that. We have a bunch of stuff here to talk about. This was going to be split into a video of Kirby plushies and then Ugly Doll and, and FNAF and the other one. But I was too lazy to do that, so we're going to do this all in one here. We have a lot of stuff to get through. So first, let's start off small. I got another one of the keychains. I don't know if I mentioned that before from the Nightmare Wave. And that is of Nightmare Foxy. Which I think actually looks pretty decent, besides his back being the wrong color. But if you just paint that over, I think it's pretty great for uh, Nightmare Foxy. And I wanted to use a, a joke with him, but you know what? I don't want to use this joke right now. Um, then finally, after like years, I have the rest of camera, focus camera. The twisted buns, those being of Foxy and Chica. Which I think are absolutely crazy cool looking. Twisted Fox is my least favorite out of the Twisted ones, but he just looks so creepy. I love the how he's got like seriously they modeled two layers of teeth into him. Focus camera. Why are you not focusing? Do you see all the detail like he's in the dirt? The claw, he's got the barnacle hook. He just looks nasty. Barnacles over his back. Disgusting. But maybe my third favorite out of the Twisted Ones is Twisted Chica. I don't care if she's in the book. I don't care that like almost the entire community just rejects her existence. I love Twisted Chica. I like Twisted Carl. This guy I'll call the Rarl, sure. I they're just melted into her. She just looks so nasty. And I bet she's actually got like these bird hands. Looks super cool. I love her. And Helpy, as you've probably seen in another video. I finally have Helpy. And yes. The Mighty Jimmy jokes. Oh, I actually really like this plus, and I think it turned out well. So it's awesome. And we have another one for the Pizzeria Simulator one, so we're out of the FNAF 6 characters, I think we're just missing as of right now. Um, I've come across Candy Cadet a few times, I'm just not going to pick them up. Better the other ones. Uh, L Chip, Lefty, and Happy Frog, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's it. I want my Rockstar Bonnie, my Scrap Trap, where are they? Anyway, next we have Ugly Worm. A green Ugly Worm. And he looks great. And yes, we have another Ugly Worm Dad the collection. I made the original uh, custom plush years ago. He was my second ever custom plush, I think, probably. And he was actually the blue one. And then I bought the figure, which was like for five bucks. And he was also blue. And now for this one, we have the green one. Will the green and blue be like separate characters in the series? Maybe. And then this is a weird one. We have a big purple tray. It's like really soft from the movies. 
or from the movie, which I didn't think was that good, but you know, maybe tarnish the ugly doll brand a little bit, but uh, you know, that's what the ugly uh, tubers are for. We need to keep ugly dolls alive and uh, ignore that. Except this looks pretty nice and it's really nice and soft. I do like the designs from the movie. I'll give them that. The designs from the movie are pretty nice. I don't know why Trey was purple, but I really like it actually. And she's got glasses. But for this one, we're gonna have it as a joke. This is gonna be Grandpa Trey. Like Sparkle's grandpa or some shit. Hey, what you doing there, Sonny? Mind giving me some prune juice? He'll be like one of Target's friends or something. All right, off of that stuff. And now we're gonna finally move on to the Kirby plushies, starting with, oh my goodness. Gracious. The camera quality is probably gonna be off of this video. I really apologize for that guy. The focusing. Um. We have Rick, who is on off of Amazon, like sold out for like months and months and months. I was like, okay, is he ever gonna come back? Cause I'm gonna buy the other two when he comes out. And he did. And they are actually a lot smaller than I thought. So yeah, they're great. Uh, oof. I love the detail. These seem to actually be based off of their Dreamland 2 and 3 art rather than their Star Allies ones, even though these came out. These were probably released because of Star Allies, so. Now, also, yeah, Gooey's getting an official plush and a dirge. So I'm assuming we may get all the Dream Friends as plushies. So I'm waiting for some of the other characters to come out. And we have my favorite of the Animal Trio, Kine, who is really awesome, really well done. He just looks fine. He's just a sunfish, but he looks great. And you just use them as a random fish plush in videos because I don't have one. I don't have a cheap cheap either. I should probably just pick one up or something. But overall, he looks great. I love, I love the colors on him. He looks so cool. And then for the coolest member of the trio, get it? Koo? Cool look at that. Is Koo, which is a purple owl with like really nice hair. I kept a thing on him, so it looks like he's flying! And something I didn't know, his tummy it looks like it's a different material. So it's like he's got these big puffy feathers. Which is really nice. He's got these, he's got bird feet. His mouth just looks super funny for some reason. I don't know what the expression is, but it looks funny. Overall, these are absolutely amazing plushies. I think these came out last year? I think so, yeah. Sometime, I don't know when. On to Flamberge, who I think, they aren't uh, the best accurate with eyes, but I think they're pretty accurate, and I base them off of Francisca, who I will put over here. Overall, I, the hair was like the most complicated. So you can see these were each individually cut out, each stuffed. Then I had to make the hats separately, their hands, chains and all that, and their faces. They look really nice. And then we have Zan. She's got yellow accents this time. Deeper her hair. She's got her little makeup, her eyes. Overall, I think they actually turned out really well. And with these dream friends coming around, I think, I am just hoping that official plushies of these guys would drop because I've been waiting and waiting and waiting that's why I didn't make them for forever. And then when I made Francisco, I was like, you know what? Maybe I'm going to hold out a bit until then. But they so far have not announced them yet. And then finally we get on to the newest out of the bunch over here. Highness. Who I finished maybe two days ago. For just the character design, which is actually somewhat simple uh, on the outside. He looks pretty great. He looks weird from the bottom because it's like you can see those lines there. This is brown and this is like red. But I think it's awesome. And you can make it so like this part downward is like not stuffed. So you can move it like this way or even with the stuff. You can just move it to his face. He's like, <gasps> all that. He's got this little Jim Bastion little emblem there. He's got like a little signs. There's robe and all that. I think it looks great. 
And then, you can take off the mask. This I wasn't the most proud of, but hey, you can get the point. Uh, I gave him a neck a bit, which also helps with this, and helps him just make him look better. He's got his big nose, his stuffed, his crazy eyes, and his little horns, ears, that are kind of similar to Magmo's. I don't know what they are. I don't know what he is. Is he Squidward? Next to the chameleon? No one knows. Maybe he's related to Camellio Arm from, um... Superstar. Who knows? Whoa! That was a bit of a crazy one. And that actually only took 10 minutes. Wow, normally I, it takes forever. So, uh, well, here's the upload schedule for uh, you guys, actually. Because this is actually gonna be pretty simple. So, originally, this was gonna be split into two videos. So, uh, well, it's not. And you're gonna get this today. And also this week, you're going to get, since someone came out in FNAF AR, and he's got updated voice lines, expect to see a Mangle voice video coming around soon. And then, here's the big surprise fun stuff. So, next week is when Ugly Dolls Season 3 Episode 2 drops, or Episode 22? Yeah, and then the week after that is finally when the next Kirby episode drops. And no, it's not going to have any of these guys in it. So you get to see them first here. Yeah. So I think, yeah, that's uh, all I'm gonna hold out for now. I'm not gonna promise to make any other promises, except definitely you're gonna get the Mangle video, you're gonna get the video, the Kirby Pulse video, um, two weeks after, and the week before that, we're gonna get the Ugga Dolls episode, and that one is going to be the one, um, that's sort of the somewhat remake of episode one, the original one, with a twist, obviously because we're in a whole different house. Gosh, this makes me feel freaking old, just saying that, like, like, that was years ago, I think that was my first... Yeah, that was like four years ago, and Dave's like almost four years old, pretty much. The channel. And that's crazy. That is crazy. And I seriously thank all of you guys so much for all the support. What in the world? Okay, you can do some weird updated things with the camera. I didn't know you could do. Huh. Well, what do you know? Well, there you go. This is the Kirby, Ugly Dolls, and FNAF uh, stuff. We have pops, we have plushies and keychains, custom plushies. Yeah, we got a, we got a lot in here. <laughs> just a big, just a bunch of random stuff. And then we got a bunch of other stuff here. Oh, well. Hope you guys enjoyed. And hope you guys are excited for those big projects. And prepare to see Squeedle make the turn after. <laughs> Like almost two and a half months of just not doing anything. Squeeze! Come along with me.